I happen to have, this is my body graph with the current transits, and I happen to have the entire stream of capitalism making money. And, um, you know, we have the gate of ambition there. There's just a lot of really yummy, juicy energy to work with. So I'm so excited that you're here and that we're going to be talking about um, how you're here to be successful by design from a profit potential standpoint as far as where are you here to make money. So in order to really get clear on this, I wanted to make sure that um, I use some real life examples so that you can see from my experience that I've actually implemented and used this in my practice and it works. I'm going to start with some some stories because stories I find teach a lot and um, we don't have enough time to do everybody's chart in real depth. So the biggest thing I'm going to focus on is any place that you guys have a third line in your design. So you're going to want to bring your chart out in front of you. Make sure that you look at, down at your design. And if you have a third line gate activation in your design, I want to start talking about your design first. So please go ahead and, and take a look at that. And um, as an example, we have three undefined centers with three third lines, and that's going to show us where Lavina has the potential to make money. So we're looking at Lavina has the potential to make money when it comes to teaching other people how to make money because here's the channel of money. Here it comes with the um, undefined heart center that is the wisdom potential about willpower to provide for your tribe, manage the tribe to help give them work. So one of the things that my mind is always um, contemplating is how can I help my people be successful? The people on my team, the people that I um, teach like you, how can I help them or encourage them to have what they need in order to make money? Yeah, I have a lot of the stream of capitalism in um, undefined centers. So we have activations where there's a lot of wisdom or, or learning and interest, we could say, in the undefined centers. Now, when it comes to the head center where we have an undefined gate 61 line three, it's about collaborating with people to help find their inner truth. So I make money with recognizing what's inspiring. So and the biggest profit potential, by the way, is the totally open center. That's a totally huge hook as far as how I make money is being able to find out what can we really be certain of. Basically turning your shadows out here to how do you support others with that wisdom that you are always contemplating with your mind. When recognized and invited, obviously, because I'm a projector. So I make money by teaching Ra's system. It's not my system. I don't make this stuff up. It's something that I take from him and I teach from my experience, right? So the biggest wisdom potential with an undefined ashna, totally open ashna, is to be able to educate because we're suckers for that, for learning. So wherever you're a sucker for, you can also sell other people on walking that thin type rope or walking that line of, you know, sell to the not self, but activate the true self. So everywhere we have undefined centers, we have an ability to sell people on something. For me personally, my moon, my driving force has this focus of always wanting to collaborate, to be interdependent with people. No, we need each other. We need to come together. Let's figure this out. How does it work for you? Yeah, from the experiential plane. All third lines are experiential. From the actual experiment of trial and error, that's what you figure out what works out there in the material plane. So. I've given you some examples of my personal third lines. My last one is part of my life's work, my, my incarnation cross. So being able to have the wisdom potential of having, having to commit to something or one's life to something so deeply that, you know, and I don't know when enough is enough. I probably overdo it all the time with human design, but I can't help it. It's just part of my, my mind and how it, it functions. But the recognition of how to help other people know when to stop. When to say no, because the gate of saying yes is also the gate of saying no. Yeah, it's being able to to dedicate or commit oneself to a process of discovery. 
to succeed where others fail. So those are my wisdom potentials. How do I help people have boundaries, help people have uh, wisdom about their willpower or their money to be their own boss? 21 threes have to be their own boss so I can teach other people how to be their own bosses. And then to be able to collaborate to help people find their inner truth. That's where my primary profit potentials are. Now on the undefined splenic center, I haven't spoken there because I don't have a third line there. But if I did, I would talk to you about it. 